Yo, what's up? It's your boy Ambitious Kid back with another Castic 3 I'm a piano video. So, guys, if you're new to this channel, please click the subscribe button below for more videos because I'm gonna be releasing new dope I'm a piano videos on how to make beats like Gabza, like Vigro Deep, and many more artists that are dope. Okay, guys, so today's tutorial is all about how to fix your shaker, make it aligned with the beat, with the beat, and then how to fix your kicks too because many people are struggling about with these factors these two factors of shakers and kicks on how to especially the shaker because the shaker doesn't mostly align itself with the beat so okay problem solved today guys I'm, i have a solution for all of that so guys i've already made a project already so i'm gonna make you guys go through a quick go through i'm gonna make you guys listen to this beat that I've made and then I'm gonna explain the tips and tricks later okay here's the beat okay guys hope you heard it so let me start with the kicks guys okay the problem that is mostly faced with the kicks is that mostly everyone's kicks are we put the kicks high with a high volume so that's not how it must it should be the kicks should be low the kicks must be low they must the volume of the kicks must be low okay so that's how to make your kicks sound properly okay so now moving on to the shaker my shaker is already aligned right here so guys let's say my shaker is like this which is not aligned which it's wrong with the beat as you can see it or maybe let's say my shaker is like this which is not aligned with the beat so i have a i have a solution for that so what you should do right here is to go to the level the level press on the level okay you will see your shaker right here and then what you do is go to tools you press the tools and then at this side you look at the detect bpm you click it you click on this detect bpm just like that and then it will tell you a number mine has written 114 right now it ain't visible because of too much light inside of my room so my bpm is 114 right here so what i'm gonna do when it's 114 you go to the you press this three line thingy okay right here you press it and then it will take you right here on this i don't know what this, i can call this but it will take you right here so you go to the tempo bpm as you can see here mine was at 114 so i took i took this this tempo bpm and then i'm gonna put it at 114 so it can align with my shaker because of but guys, it's not always 114. Sometimes it's 116, sometimes it's 112, sometimes it's another number. So you can put it at that number that it says. Sometimes other shakers could be like 170. They could be on 170. So what you do is that you divide it. You divide it. It's like half of 170 and then something like that but it's rare that problem is really rare so that's the trick of shakers if it's on 114 you put it on 114 if you put it if, if it's one it's on one one three whatever it is you put it right there so yeah that's how it is guys and i'm going to be sending shakers to my subscribers guys so please don't forget to click that subscribe button and if you haven't subscribed yet please 
run and click that subscribe button below because of the offer is limited guys so the offer is limited i don't know the date yet but the, it is it is a limited offer guys so you should hurry and click that subscribe button so you can get shakers because many people don't have this cakes so i want to send you guys this cakes because they are more professional than any other and i'm gonna send you a bunch of my shakers okay guys so that's the tutorial i hope you've learned something i hope you've learned something smarter okay.